Hi, I'm Chaplain Byron Denman, and this is Chats with the Chaplain. Have you guys ever made a plan and it just didn't work out? Why was that? Did somebody else interfere with the plan? Or maybe did you fail to account for some variable that you had to have included or else the plan couldn't function? In the Army, many of you have probably heard the expression or the phrase, no plan survives first contact. So over and over again, we, we make our plans and that's necessary, but we expect that something happens when the enemy gets a say, right? So even though our plan can be exactly how we want it to be, if the enemy doesn't do exactly what we expected them to do, then everything changes. If we have this plan and it's all worked out and every detail is accounted for and, and we don't lose anything through the preparation, through the rehearsals or, or whatever steps we have to follow, and then the enemy does exactly what we think they will do, then maybe a plan could survive first contact. That simply never happens though. I could tell you with these chats with the chaplain, there are many times when I sit down and I think I know exactly what I'm gonna say. I think I know how I want the whole thing to play out and I'll get 20 seconds in and I'll say something and I'll just cut the transmission and say, nope, because it's not what I wanted to say. Maybe even I've changed completely the idea behind what I was going to say. And so I'll spend a couple of recordings on one idea and then switch over to another. And then maybe I switch back to the other one. Because as I'm going through these chats, I realize that there's something else that needs to be said. Just this morning, my son said, I thought you had all these things planned out. And I said, well, I kind of do. But as I'm speaking, I realize that there might be something else that needs to be shared. No plan survives first contact. And when I make contact with the camera, my plans don't survive that. As you are developing your plans, as you're figuring out what you're doing next month, next weekend, the rest of your life, after the Army, I need you to understand that things aren't going to go exactly the way that you plan them. There will be challenges that arise that you could not foresee. There will be people in your lives who help in a way that you couldn't have predicted. And then there will be those other people who don't help so much and actually make your plan a little bit harder to follow. Either way, as you go through time, as you try to adjust your life to the circumstances that you're facing, as you try to make your plans, I need you to understand that there's a pretty good chance something's going to be shaken a little bit in that plan. And that's okay. We have to develop the flexibility to deal with that, to roll with the punches. I'm Chaplain Byron Denman, and don't let your plan keep you stuck where you are in your life.